Hi there, I want to give you an overview of the second quarter PD plan as well as some updates. Right in the middle is the link that will take you to where you can update your goal from first quarter and if you're still working on that particular goal and also to input your goal for second quarter. If you'll scroll down, you'll notice that there are some hyperlinks. Anything that says registration, you would click on those are events that are held at the um, WECC. The reflection link is just like the first quarter that takes you there. You'll notice this uh, WIDA 1.0 is for new teachers only. It's a requirement. Anybody can attend, but specifically only new teachers in this mission section. There's a link to the district PD agenda for um, November 8th. And then if you scroll down, I wanted to bring your attention to the learning walk. If you would click on the link, it will take you to a spreadsheet where you can fill in uh, your name, who you're visiting, the date and time, and the content that you were observing. Don't get real detailed here uh, because there is an actual reflection link. So I'm gonna close that off and take you back. There is a reflection link right there so that you can fill that in. If we look down at the additional missions, remember these are optional. Um, you want to have a combined uh, total points of 12 points between the missions and the additional missions. But if we look down here, you'll notice that I uh, have some strikethroughs. The district data-driven decision meeting on the 10th has been canceled. So I went ahead and also canceled our moving forward on the 15th. However, I added on those two days this section, Eureka Chat and Chew. The topic for these particular sessions is going to be what's the point of the debrief. I've got some information that I think you just might be interested in. What you'll also know is that we have an or you'll notice, excuse me, is that we have an RSVP button. Last time, uh, last quarter, I didn't have an RSVP button, so it was really kind of hard to plan, knowing to know how many people were uh, attending or not going to be able to attend, etc. The RSVP button is for you just to let me know that if you're going to be there. You don't have to tell me if you're not, but just if you're going to be there. So anything that has RSVP, please make sure you fill that out. Okay. If you are interested in joining the Whole Brain Teaching, if you click on this link right here, this will pull up a playlist for you. And just to give you a brief overview, if you start here, Amy Hartung put together a fabulous slideshow. And on the slideshow, it has um, the hyperlinks to chapters. It will have some summaries. It will have some videos. And it will have a Padlet for each chapter or series of chapters. So for instance, if I go down here, this is chapter four, charting progress. We have a Padlet that if you read that Padlet, you can go in, or if you read that chapter, you can go into the Padlet and you can post on there. Please put your name on the post so that we know that's you who's done that. If I take you back, the reason chapter four doesn't have a hyperlink there is because it gets all the way up here at the top, chapters one to four, they're all right there. So if you click on those links, it will take you to the document. You'll need to either um, read that online or print it, and you can just flip it very easily. Taking you back, we have the PowerPoint. As I said, Amy's gone through and put in some great uh, videos that correspond to the chapters. The hyperlinks will take you to the chapters. And the expectations are between now and the end of this quarter for three points that you would um, read and respond on at least uh, three of the Padlets. And those Padlets are available right there. I'm going to take you back to the playlist. On the playlist, if you uh, just want the specific chapters, you can find them here as well. Um, I've got the posters um, that uh, are we're using in the classrooms and a little video to show you how to uh, switch the PDF view. We'll also be adding additional resources there. But if you are uh, participating in the book study, it will be going on all year. So uh, just start here, let us know. And again, if I go all the way back to our um, document that uh, there is an RSVP for that just so that um, we know who's participating. 
um, in the book study and um, we can keep track of that. Okay, finally, the last thing is I'm going to, my goal is to get a bulletin board put up in the uh, teacher's lounge that will have the weekly heads up and it will say what spoke to you and basically is if you read an article from the weekly heads up if you could just write um, you know just some type of a, a little quick um, actually you could even post a reflection uh, but we'll kind of stick that up there so that um, you know we know that that um, you're reading and responding and other people will be able to do that as well thanks so much I hope that helps